having Justin back inspired our entire football team to go out and, and, and play the way that we we're capable of doing. Um, and then, and of course, it helps those guys mindset-wise where when something goes bad, they don't have to put their head down and feel feel bad about it. So having him back helped. What kind of milk was it that you were drinking during this whole time that Coach Tagger was raving about? Yeah, it was it was a lot of fun just to be back there. You know, we got great guys on this team, and it's it's so much fun to be a part of this. And it's it's awesome to to play next to him and and uh, do anything for him. And then uh, there's a lot of chocolate milk. Justin outrushed Khalil Tate. I wonder what who, who could you have possibly guess that? And what does that say about the way you guys played it on both sides of the ball? Yeah, I don't think I don't think anybody thought that was going to happen before the game. I certainly didn't. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, but, but what was the second part of the question? What does that say about the way you guys played on both sides of the ball? I mean, yeah, we played, you know, played well on offense, um, and our defense played lights out. I think that was that was really key, you know, stopping uh, stopping their quarterback. I mean, because I mean, he could have easily ran for 200, 300 yards, and our defense did a really good job, you know, the whole week of practice and today in the game. One reason it was big because we were back to getting explosive plays that that this offense thrive on, and and those explosive plays are the ones that really helped. Um, our rushing, our rushing attack. When we can get a nice pass play down the field and and follow it up with runs with the tempo, um, it always help our football team. And um, and that's kind of how it was early in the year. And um, it was good to have Herbert back and um, execute those plays like we, we know we're capable of. But whenever you can throw the ball down the field, it always um, help your running running game, especially when you're pretty good at running the football. Justin, with everything you've been through in the last several weeks, can you just walk us through what it felt like to to break off that forty yard run at the beginning of the game? Yeah, it was a little surprising. Um, there was there was a little bit of pressure, and so I I, I kind of got out to the left and and uh, didn't see anyone in front of me, so I decided to take off, and and luckily I got in the end zone. If there was a, a report, I believe, on ESPN saying that you're unhappy at Oregon and you're looking to leave. Can you address that? Do I look unhappy? <laughs> Not tonight, no. <laughs> I'm not addressing any more rumors. You might have to ask that guy, whoever put that rumor out there. I'm tired of answer, answering those. I answered that before. But do I look unhappy? Not tonight. Did I, do I ever look unhappy? <laughs> I think you always see a good smile, don't you? You, you do. You smile well. Absolutely. <laughs> Winning is living, baby. I'm happy. I only had one question for uh, Uncle Phil, and that was, do Nike make bowling shoes? Uh, <laughs> 